So guys, today I want to talk to you about a topic that one way or another, everyone should relate to. And that is a topic that sometimes, you know, I, I think some people think that they need to be in a certain area or a certain category, when in reality they don't. And so here's what I want to talk to you about. Mm -hmm. Who are you as an individual? Are you an individual that's like a business owner? Or are you an individual that works best maybe in um, being second in charge, like a CEO? And, you know, a lot of times as investors, you know, we think, well, gosh, I got to be my own thing. I got to be my own thing. I got to be the owner. I got to be the owner. And reality is that's really not necessarily always true. Sometimes being in that supporting, supportive role, sometimes being in that team environment is where you thrive the best at. Mm -hmm. And so one of the things, you know, Julie and I have done now collectively thousands of deals together. Mm -hmm. There's no question Julie can get out there and start doing her own thing. I mean, she really does not need me at this. I mean, she needs me to maybe to be at a certain level, mm -hmm. but if anybody knows this business, it's Julie. But interestingly, even before Julie and I started working with each other, mm -hmm. you ran a lawn care company, right? Mm -hmm. You ran a restaurant. You know, she didn't own the lawn care company. She didn't own the restaurant. So that's kind of been, her, you, you know, your whole thing all mm -hmm. the way through. So talk about that, Julie, like for some people that maybe don't need to be owners or don't need to be one man shows. What, mm -hmm. how, how does that? Well, you know, really like, you know, for me, um, I thrive in a team environment. Right. So if, if let's say I were to go out on my own, it's not something that would be exciting to me. If I don't have other people to compete with, yep. <laughs> if, if I you know don't have big things to do, it's, it's really hard for me to thrive in that environment. So not all the time is it necessary for you to be your own business owner. And, and to be quite honest, there's a lot of stress with owning a business. I mean, there's a lot of bills and things that need to get paid. So I feel because of my position, I get a lot of the benefits without having to yep. to get, you know give up time and energy and stress out about things that don't don't make me happy. You know what does make me happy is is doing deals. It's it's working with our people and we've built such an incredible, you know, business here. Why would I want to ever leave? You know, I call it like the the baby. Why would I want to leave something like that? And, and not always should you, you know, be your own business owner. Maybe you should partner with somebody. Um, and you might find you would do a lot better doing that than being out on your own because it is really, really, really hard to be a Lone Ranger. It really is. So, guys, this is an important thing. Do not think that just because you're in real estate mm -hmm. that all of a sudden you got to be the top dog. Top dog is just a term. It doesn't determine how much money you make, doesn't guarantee success, doesn't really guarantee anything. Um, and it does, like Julie said, comes with a lot of downside. Some of y'all will actually be better in a team environment, in a supportive environment, potentially in an employee environment. And there's nothing wrong with any of those things. But if you're putting yourself in an environment where you don't utilize your skill set correctly, where you aren't able to thrive, that in of itself can prevent you from being mm -hmm. uber successful. So guys, remember, know yourself and put yourself in a position to win. So guys, if you want to learn how to know mm -hmm. yourself, because that's one of the things we do with our partners literally all over the United States. If you want us to teach you how to find incredible real estate deals, if you want to use our money to close on all those deals, use our people, mm -hmm. our infrastructure, our resources to complete those deals, like fix them, and then we sell them together and split the profits, then you need to be a part of our part of part of our partner-driven coaching program because that's exactly what we do with partners mm -hmm. literally all over the United States. So to learn more about how you could be one of our partners, either call me directly at area code 404-915-9685 or go to our website at www.coachingbypeter.com. And it's okay to be a leader and not be the ultimate leader. Very smart. That's exactly right. Nobody looks inside this company, looks at Julie, and looks at her as like a second fiddle to anyone. So that's the exact point. Guys, know yourself and be able to thrive in the right environment. Thanks.